hi friends and welcome back to more persona so i'm gonna look at what everyone does today a lot of people ate at ayas apparently so we're gonna go and see where this aya place is and have some really delicious stuff if she's even open or is it a she or is it just a brand name i don't know let's go to living room i guess we'll just travel outside oh my god that's really loud okay hey there nanika I can watch the house. Wow, okay. Are you watching Power Rangers or Super Sentai? Okay, well, it's been raining today. Isn't that super great? Um, we'll save for real quick, real quick because why not? Um, let's see what's in here. Nothing catches your eye. Oh, how about over here? <gasps> anything in here? Oh, nope. I doubted anything would be... Doubted. Go out until evening? Sure, why not? Is this technically going to move me? Oh, I even have my little umbrella. Isn't that fantastic? Go to town? Yes. What could possibly go wrong here? Uh, I'm sure we'll go to the central shopping district. Why not? Spend some time at all the places that are fun. Uh, oh, hey, dude. How you doing? You know about the Midnight Channel? Okay. Okay. Maybe you should try it yourself. I don't know. How about you, sir? Has new books in? Oh my god, a lovely man. Okay. Some fishing ones, huh? I wonder if I can buy that fishing book. Yeah, let's buy it since we can. Because that might be worth it, at least somewhat. Um, That's the metalworks. Uh, capsule machine. Oh. No, 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 no. Oh, well. You know, I guess it couldn't be too bad. Oh my god, that's right. I forget. During the night, she's a hostess. Oh my god. Oh, you're hosting it. You know, 20% off is pretty nice. It's a rainy day sale. I see. I get it. You could buy medicine and stimulant. And there's... Go okay, we can leave the dungeon. Vanish ball. Firecracker. Oh. Oh, great. We hit We're getting into the point... Oh. We're getting to the point where basically we have items that can cast elements as well. Oh, right, Ethan. Every game kind of has that. Where's the capsule machine? I want the capsule. No, not that. Fuck. Wanted the capsule machine. I wanted to look at the capsule machine. Leave, please. Thank you. Just wanted to look at the capsule machine. God damn it. There we go. There's a line. Oh, and you currently have. Do you want to? Do you want to spend some time here? Yeah, I don't want to spend some time here. There, just yet. Thank you very much. Apparently, it's gonna take all goddamn day to get to the castle. Uh, ooh, Chinese dinner. Or I mean diner, not dinner. There's there's one in. Oh my god, three thousand yen for it if you finish. Uh, oh, it's free. Okay. You feel taking on this dish will help raise several characteristics. Well, okay, let's do it. This is probably a horrible idea, considering. Probably gonna have to pay for it all, but we'll see. Okay, rainy day special. Let's see how all this goes. You can still, you, you still can't, <laughs> you still can't see the rice. Oh god. You begin to sus suspect this portal is a, is a portal to the, uh, this bowl is a portal to the nature dimension, of course. Uh... In order to finish the bowl, you must have understanding of your limits and knowledge to control your pace, courage to face the unrelenting tide of beef, and the diligence to preserve against the colossal challenge. All those traits are necessary to master the- oh my god. You weren't able to finish the meal at your current state. Damn it! That mean I had to pay for it. Your knowledge has increased. Your courage has increased. Your diligence has increased. Okay, cool. Still have to pay, though. God damn it. Now I'm broke again. <clears throat> After you finish your meal, you went home. Well, at least I got a bunch of things up. Woohoo. Oh. Due to the weekend rainfall, clear skies seem unlikely in the area. Oh, cool. A thick fog is expected to set in tonight and remain until tomorrow morning. Oh. With heaviest concentration in the Inaba area. Anyone planning to go out tonight should take care. Now for our hourly weather breakdown. Well, thank God we saved Yukiko from that. More fog, huh? There's been a lot of that lately. Hopefully it's not a sign of more trouble. 
Are you drunk, Tochima? You just seem like you're a little bit out of it. We're very tired. Uh, uh, uh. What did I say about changing the channel without asking? Uh. Have a great day, even during Golden Week, at your local Juness. Come see for yourself and get in touch with our product. Here it comes. Every day's great at your Juness. Every day's great at your Juness. <sighs> they're going to be open during Golden Week. I'm so happy. <laughs> I heard. Do you want to go somewhere during the long holiday? We can go somewhere? Sure, why not? How about it? Got any plans yet? Not that I know of. Uh, no. I'm uh, no, no plans, I guess. I mean. Then let's all go somewhere together. Oh, great. Junus, 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 Junus. That's not exactly someplace. <laughs> okay. You sure you want to go to Juness? We can go there anytime. Yeah, what he said. Come on, girl. Time for bed. It's late. All right. Every day's great at your Juness. She probably dreams about the the jingle as well. She's just like in the middle of sleep, and it's just like every day's great at your Juness. Ah, <sighs> family outing. Alrighty then. Hey, Dojima, how you doing? <laughs> Okay, no plans right now, at least from what I can tell. Nothing catches your eye. Wonderful. Because it is the highest often. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, the TV's off. We are going up to our room. Oh my god, watch TV in your room. Sure. Guess there's no chance to actually study or anything. Damn it. It's midnight. Fog is set in. Now what could possibly go wrong now? No one is appearing on the Midnight Channel. Oh. I'm sure the killer must be very upset by that. They must be like, what the hell? When did that happen? Damn it! Okay. Oh. We're just gonna go meanwhile somewhere? Okay. Someone wasn't happy about that. Well, we ate, we ate the you know we ate a Chinese dinner. Went broke doing it. That was great on my part. Oh, hey, Yukiko. How you doing? Oh, good morning. Feeling better? Yeah, I'll be coming to school again, so that'll be nice. I caused everyone some real trouble. Oh. I'm sorry. No. Sorry isn't quite right. What I mean to say is, thank you. Oh, I'm glad you're more cheerful than before. My mother's back to work already. Good for her. The maids are being really supportive. And I think things are going even smoother than before. So you don't have to work there too much? I wonder if I was trying too hard. I may have been too caught up in the idea that I had to do everything myself. Well, as far as I'm concerned, at least you're not dead. That's the good thing, right? Ever since the incident, I feel like I can think about these things more calmly. Well, you did fight yourself over it, so I am sure it's... But it's still kind of embarrassing. Uh-huh. Don't worry about it. You guys saw everything, even the things I didn't want to admit. You've already changed. Everything's like that. Really? Yukiko! Oh, she is really oh, happy to see it. Chie. I'll go hang out with her. Well, I'll talk to you later. Yep. Have fun. I'm gonna go and... Oh. Well, I'm glad that she's doing better. So, now what? Who's gonna fall victim next? Who knows? Oh, early morning, morning. Oh shit, do we actually have... Oh god. I mean, all of you are cute. No, really. Okay. This is getting a little weird. Don't tell your parents I said that, will you? Um, anyways. Sounds like a good time to pick up on city... Oh god. 
Well, get greatest canyon in the s What? Okay, well, obviously... Uh, well, Grand Canyon's quite large. I don't think that... I've never heard of this. Eeny, meeny, money, mo, catch it, tag your buy it, if it all is... Oh my god, just fucking there! Okay, please. Dear god, I had a 1-3 chance, please. Oh my god, I was right! <sighs> oh, of course it's on Mars. Or the moon of Mars, I guess. Oh, well, it's on Mars, alright. Oh, thank god, you gave the correct answer. Your knowledge has increased. Oh, I went from aware to informed. I'm so happy. Seriously? I was just... I fucking... Christ. Oh, hey, Yukiko. Sorry to keep you waiting. The soap was yours, right, Chie? Thanks! Oh, that smells so good! Hey, where's ours? Come on. These instant noodles are just the thing to help me through club. How much longer do I have to wait on this? Just eat it. I mean, seriously. It still needs a few minutes. Oh. Well. Never mind. Okay, you two just... So why are we here? Oh, yeah. We were gonna ask Yukiko what happened. Yes. Yukiko-san, I hate to bring up stuff you'd rather not think about, but I need to ask you again. Hmm? Did you recall anything about when you got kidnapped? No. Oh, great. Well... I thought I might remember something if I let it sit for a while, but as time passes, it only gets hazier. I think... the doorbell rang at the entrance, and someone called for me. But when I woke up after that, hmm. I was already in the castle. I'm sorry. Well, I have to say the Ultra U was pretty adamant about that no castle. Need to apologize. Pretty crazy. She was looking for her prince. But does this mean her visitor is the culprit? Don't know. I don't know. If it's true, then that's one daring criminal. What kind of killer would ring the doorbell? The police are probably looking for witnesses, but I don't think we can expect much from them. <laughs> As if the culprit wore bright yellow clothes at the scene of the crime. Hmm. Well, this has amounted to much of nothing. why whoever it is would do stuff like this. Uh, to kill people? Maybe they like we killing people, I don't know. We confront them ourselves. But we can be sure of one thing. It's no coincidence that people keep ending up in that place. Hmm. Someone on our side is definitely kidnapping them and throwing them into the TV. It's murder, all right. Oh yeah, we never told you. This guy and me are gonna catch the culprit ourselves. Just you two, okay. The police are out of their league on this case, but we got personas. Never fear, we'll get... Could you lend us a hand? Huh? Um... I'm helping out too! Oh good, Chie's helping out too. I can't believe someone would throw people into a place like that. I'm gonna sock whoever's doing this! You do that, young lady. Chie. Oh crap, I forgot to go and get jobs. Damn it. I could get all the jobs according to some comment on and thank you, Lily, for uh commenting on that. Uh someone is Lily, anyways. Let uh, me help too. Okay, cool. Yukiko is gonna help out. I wanna know why this is happening. Especially if someone hates me so much they wanna kill me. I don't wanna run away from myself anymore. Alright. And let's all work together and catch this asshole. Okay. Agreed. What other things could possibly go wrong? And Yukiko joined the group. She's definitely the strongest asset in solving the case. And social link. Oh, investigation team. Now, okay. Well, that ranked up. Rank two is pretty good for investigation team. I'm cool with that. Yay! But how are we gonna find them? We don't have a single lead yet. Okay. Well. I'm the third one to be targeted so far, but I have a feeling this isn't the end of it. Well, last time... If we had an idea of who might be targeted next, wouldn't we have an advantage over the killer? Last time, I'm pretty sure you were targeted because you were on television, young lady. So we'll outsmart them, huh? Yeah, that might work. Okay, so let's see if we can figure out what ties the victims together. First, there was that announcer, Mayumi Yamano. Second was Saki Konishi. Senpai. Third, was Yukiko Amagi. 
What do they all have in common? They were all on the television. They're all f female. They all live in Inaba. They're all female. Bingo. How dare he target females? Now that's unforgivable. The culprit's got to be some kind of pervert. Oh my god. Also, what about this? The second and third victims had some sort of connection to the first one. Hey, that's right! Yukiko and Saki-senpai both had connections to that announcer! That's true. You were all on television. Then does that mean females connected in some way to Miss Yamano's case? I'm meeting a television star. That's all I, I can think about. That's a safe about. assumption for now. <laughs> Anyways, okay. There's another angle we can take, too. If another person disappears... You think they'd be on that Midnight Channel? That happened right before Yukiko was kidnapped, too. Hmm. Yeah. It's hard to tell who at first, but what's important is, it's happened before the victims disappeared. Kind of like a ransom note. Well, that's one hell of a ransom we note. Still don't know why that to, happens, especially with Yukiko's, I mean. That was like, wow. The next time it rains. Hmm. Who's going to rain again? Okay. You must remember to watch it on the next rainy night. Okay. By the way, aren't those done by now? You know, your food. Whoa, that's right. Chow time! We better fade to black before we watch TA eat. Oh, God. Hey, could I try just a little bit of that? Just one tiny bite? Hands off the soba, pal. Go get your own if you want some. Okay. Just one bite, got it? No. Oh. He's gonna eat all of it, isn't he? <laughs> Do you want to try some? Try a bite, yep. Yeah. Or eat all of it. I should eat all of it. Okay. It's so good. The aroma, the flavor, and the texture all combined. This is perfect! Oh, great. Oh, no. Ah! What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Whoops. You ate everything! I don't owe you anything. My fried tofu. Ugh. It was so delicious. Hmm. Stop! I'm sorry! I'll buy you steak! It'll be on me! You hear me? The very best! Steak? Oh, great. And tofu. Come on, Yukiko! There's steak in it for us now! <laughs> we can eat instant noodles anytime we want, right? Well, as long as it isn't too fatty. Oh, of course. It's not like you're eating bread and butter. Okay, we've reached the verdict. You are hereby sentenced to buying a steak. Oh, great. That wouldn't be too fatty. Filet? Ooh, filet sounds nice and expensive. Filet, 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 filet mignon. What have you gotten us into, Yosuke? Hey, you've got a pony up too. You're just as much to blame. Oh, for God's sakes. Great. Am I going to lose more of my money over this? I really fucking hope not. Great. Man, talk about great timing. We just started serving grilled steak today. We're doing our part to spread this town's specialty dish. Plus, we've already got an excellent grill. That's just the yakisoba griddle. Oh, well. Steak is steak. It's far from a filet steak, though. Yeah, well, you're not getting filet mignon. I'm sorry. No. Yukiko, you can are you eat okay that. with this? It's not too heavy for you? I'll eat it. I'm still mad. Oh, great. So back on topic, I wonder what <sighs> kind of person the culprit is. Mm. If you focus just on the announcer's case, it seems like a revenge thing. Maybe it was her lover's wife. Really? But Mizuzu Hiragi had a solid alibi, didn't she? And it seemed like she was already separated from her husband. Doesn't mean, I mean, she might have hired someone to do it. Really? You know an awful lot about this. Are you it? Okay, what about the second case? Saki-senpai. 
She found the announcer's body. Assuming the same person killed them both, then why target Senpai? Mm hmm. Hmm. It was a coincidence. I think it was a coincidence. Well, we can't rule out that possibility. But maybe it was to keep her quiet. Like she found evidence that led to the culprit. No, I think it was a coincidence. But the killer just threw the announcer into a TV, right? The killer is actually Teddy. I'm betting on that. He would have left evidence the police he's far too adorable. High school student would catch. He thinks he's just a cute, cuddly teddy bear, but in yeah, secret, exactly. he has many knives. Man, I thought the countryside would be a snooze, but it's proving to be a lot more exciting than I thought. Oh, they updated the menu. Huh? Isn't he that detective? Yeah, that's a dachi, right? Oh, hey, Adachi. Hey, you were at Dojima-san's. <laughs> I'm not. Oh, wait. Hey, this is great timing after all. Dojima-san said that he'll be leaving work on schedule tonight. Could you pass that on to Nanako-chan? Uh, sure. I... Yo, I'm Adachi. Dojima-san's gopher. Uh, I mean, his partner. Oh, I like gopher better. Are you this busy every day? Huh? Oh, well, the public seems to be getting a charge out of these cases. But we can't leave it at that. Sorry to butt in, but could it be that the killer targeted Saki Senpai in order to silence her? Um, we sure get to the heart of the matter. Yikes. <laughs> of course, we're also thinking along those lines. She was killed right after the announcer's body was found. Mm. If the killer mm. was trying to silence her, there might have been something at the scene only she would have understood. The killer is Chie. There we go. Done. Which would mean that the culprit may be someone close to Miss Konishi. Or maybe the killer's the maker of the stake. Nothing like that points to Misuzu Hiragi, so... Oh, I might have stumbled across something here. Wait, are you listening to all that? Crap, me and my big mouth. Uh, don't tell anyone I said any of that, or Dojima-san will flay me alive. <clears throat> Relax, kids. The police are on the job. See ya. Oh, what a great detective. He's kind of awkward. Okay. You're right, Yosuke. The police are totally useless. <laughs> ah, my steak's getting cold. Yeah, I was about to say, aren't you going to eat? Could you shut up about the steak for five seconds? <laughs> and then it fades to black. Then you decided to go into the TV world. Hey, I did not. Oh my God, this is a sudden transition into warping. Oh fuck. Well, all right. I'm okay with this in some regard. So, uh, how we doing? Wow, this really is inside the TV. Oh, hey, Teddy. It's Teddy. Then it wasn't a dream. Are you feeling better, Yuki-chan? I did what you said. I've been a good bear. Oh, my God. Oh, I see. Good boy. <laughs> Uh, now it seems like we're treating him like a dog. Oh god, he doesn't well, seem... this bear's part of the reason we want to find the culprit. <laughs> Except, yeah, he's kind of a giant bear. It's kind of hard to ignore that fact, isn't it? I'm one of the group now, too. Let's work together, okay? Yep, I was thinking the same thing. That's why I got these ready for you, Yuki-chan. Glasses. Yep, glasses. Oh, so these are what everyone's wearing. Thank you, Teddy. Why are they all so stylish? Teddy, you should open, like, a boutique. You're right. I swear. It's just as if the fog doesn't exist. Hey, tell me something. How come you have so many pairs of glasses? It's a good question. It's a good question. question. Guess what? I'm the one who makes them. Really? Wow. I've lived here for a long time, so I came up with some ways to be comfortable here. But these glasses aren't built. Okay. I see. But don't you need a pair? He's a pair. He's Ooh, a bear. Good point. Another great question. Okay. Can Listen you? Listen to this. My eyes themselves are lenses. No, of course. You didn't know. Of course not. Why are you being so mean? You act like you're not interested. Well, to be fair, I'm kind of not. I'm a really dexterous bear. <laughs> dexterous bear. See how smoothly my fingers move. Okay. Oh, God. What am I even looking at? 
<laughs> wow, just push. Oh, he's back. Okay. Hmm? You dropped something. Oh, that's a pair I kind of screwed up on. How did you screw up on them? <laughs> oh. Y Yukiko? <laughs> How do I look? Oh, my goodness. I don't think you screwed up on that. I think you did a brilliant job. <laughs> look, <laughs> looks great. <laughs> do you like that one, Yuki chan? I want to wear this one. It's even got a nose guard. <laughs> of course it does. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> How very unfortunate. That pair doesn't have the right lenses in. Aww. Guess I should have made an actual pair. Why did you add the nose and the mustache then? Too bad. Here, Chie, your turn. Oh, goody. Man. All right. Give me, give me, give me. I want to wear. Come on, let me wear. Damn it. To this. <laughs> Chie, you look even more beautiful than before. Hello. There goes one of Yukiko's laughing fits. I never thought she'd do it when someone besides me was around. Well, there you go. These stupid glasses are useless for investigating. I mean, what the hell is this nose for anyway? Teddy, could you please supply a question for I mean, answer nice to that work, question? Huh? That's what happens when you guys leave me here alone, and I get bored. You make crappy glasses. Okay. I'll keep well, them, though. I'm glad that she's in high spirits again, I guess. <laughs> oh, Chie, the look on your face. <laughs> it was so funny. <laughs> I can't... <laughs> Okay, Yukiko, you need to calm down. It's not that funny. Great. So, uh, we are now going to evening? Oh, good. What are we going to spend the evening doing now? Hey, it's family the fourth time. fourth and the fifth. Hmm? I think I might be able to get the fourth and the fifth off. Oh, cool. <gasps> really? Really? What, you don't believe me? It's always cancelled. <laughs> oh my god. Don't be such a Debbie Downer. Not every year. I know you wanted to go to Jeunesse, but I wouldn't mind going a little further out of the neighborhood. Really? <laughs> Can we go on a trip? Uh, well, it might be okay to go on a trip once in a while. Okay. I'm sure it'll be crowded everywhere, though. Yeah! Trip. She's so easily satisfied by this. Mm. All right, all right. Then we need to think of some place to go. Can we go to the moon? I think you? the moon would be a good place to go. Along with us? Well, sure. Yeah, well, let's all go together. <laughs> Looks like Nanako wants us all to go. Let's bring box lunches. Hmm. Yeah, good idea. We're always eating side dishes for dinner. But uh, I can't cook, and Nanako's not good enough yet to make them by herself. Are you going to hmm. tell me to... Oh, no. Well, it'll work out. That's what <laughs> we got this guy for, huh, Nanako? Oh, great. Yeah, just sign me up for the job. Wonderful. Yay! Box lunches! <sighs> just sign me on up for that, won't you? Okay. Nothing catches your eye. All right. Nanaka, are you watching that quiz show again? <laughs> she can't wait for the vacation. Great. Okay. Well, <laughs> we're going to end the episode here after I got assigned bunch, uh, lunchbox duty. Great. See you guys soon. Thanks for watching.